Brian Slocum, of course, weather has a lot to do with our fair plans. <laughs> and I mean, they couldn't ask for a better opening weekend, right? I, the whole week. The whole Looks week really is looking good. great. Okay. This is rare. This doesn't happen very much. So uh, usually there's rain or a tropical system right. or a storm with a first name that starts to come through. And it, yeah, it's, it's that time of year, but we're looking OK so far. Okay. I'm hoping by next weekend. Uh, um, things are looking just as good, but good. Uh, getting a little iffy. We are getting lucky, time. but I'm sure we do need the rain eventually next week. We we should, and hopefully by late in the week, we can at least get a little bit of rain uh, so you don't have to water the grass seed that you just put down. Uh, for folks who are cutting back the hay this time of year, get a nice stretch of weather to do that. But your fair forecast uh, for this weekend uh, looking good. Uh, what else do you need to know about the fair? Funnel cakes, pig races, demolition derby, all in the same place. You got to love it. All right, mixed skies. Got a comfortable day today. Temperatures are on the rise. We got into the low to mid 70s yesterday afternoon and mid to upper 70s for the weekend as well. A nice warm ish fall day, but it's supposed to be in the mid to upper 70s this time of year. We still have some cloud cover over the Winston Salem skyline right now. Conditions are close to 60 degrees. Comfortably cool out there this morning with the north breeze at about five miles per hour. Dew points are in the upper 50s, so we've got a little bit of a room to cool things down. This is kind of a temperature floor, so to speak. Once you get to that, that's when you often see fog starting to kind of condense out. So we're not there yet, especially not with a cloud cover this morning. Uh, temperatures uh, low to mid 70s yesterday afternoon actually got to 73 degrees in Greensboro yesterday. 75 though in Burlington, 74 from Winston Salem to Lexington. These numbers are still a little bit cooler than average. That's something we've seen quite a bit of uh, this week. Records again, haven't had a lot of record temperatures of late. In fact, we haven't even been in the ballpark. It's been pretty, pretty normal uh, for much of this time. Uh, temps right now, 61 in High Point, Greensboro, 59 in Madison and Moxville uh, this morning. Farther west, we have temperatures in the low to mid 50s, as cool as 55 in Boone, where some heavy clouds are in place. They should start to thin out by mid or late morning. Uh, we go from cloudy to mostly cloudy to partly sunny and then mostly sunny by this afternoon. North northeast winds are relatively light, should stay under 10 miles per hour today. For the foothills in and out of some cloud cover, high near 77 this afternoon and mountain temperatures are close to the lower 70s. That's where we were yesterday with a light breeze over the area. We got twin tropical storms uh, out there now. Rena christened yesterday before lunchtime. Philly, uh, Philippe and Rena, the two storms. Uh, fortunately for us, both are expected to stay way out into the Atlantic. We'll start with Philippe, kind of a slow drifter, and then this starts to get picked up by a trough and starts to move uh, into the central Atlantic. It should strengthen a little bit, but remain as tropical storm. Rena, the new one, uh, we'll continue to watch this one. It's just to the right of Philippe. And this storm expected to take more of a westerly track initially and eventually steer in kind of a similar circumstance uh, likely won't develop much at all. Uh, fortunately, storms 16 and 17 on the season uh, should not get anywhere near the United States. Uh, look at the seven day forecast looking very nice. Temperatures ranging for highs of 76 to 78 degrees. How's that for consistency? Uh, morning lows will also be in the 50s, so some nice fall weather this week.